Do not swap power failure circuit board on hard drive if you care about data. One such challenge is the recent trend of hard drive manufacturers using surface mount technology, SMT, to build circuit boards for their drives. In this video post, we will explore why swapping circuit boards on hard drives is a bad idea, and what you can do to avoid losing your data in the process. The dangers of swapping circuit boards. When it comes to data protection, swapping circuit boards is generally not a good idea. If the new board is not compatible with the existing data on the hard drive, it could result in corruption or even complete destruction of the data. Let's we understand swap PCB as dangers by two working hard drives practical example. Seagate Hard Drive 1 Model ST3500312 CSS, N9VV71NST. Seagate Hard Drive 2 Model ST3500312 CSS, N5VVD2A7R. Hard Drive 1 and Hard Drive 2. Connected both working hard drive with tools. Both hard drive detected working fine in tools. Now check swap PCB isolate hard drive 1 circuit board and similar isolate hard drive 2 circuit board. Swap hard drive 1 circuit board to hard drive 2 and vice versa. Now connect with tools to check hard drive is detected or not. Hard drive is not detected after swapping PCB also getting clicking sound from hard drive. Set original status both hard drive 1 and hard drive 2 circuit board. Detected both hard drives as fine in tools. You can understand swapping circuit board is very dangerous. Another danger of swapping circuit boards is that it can void the warranty on your hard drive. Finally, swapping circuit boards can also lead to physical damage to your hard drive. For these reasons, it is generally best to avoid swapping circuit boards on hard drives altogether. How to avoid swapping a circuit board? If you have a hard drive with a failing circuit board, it is important to avoid swapping the circuit board. First, try to find a replacement hard drive that has the same model number as your current hard drive. Second, if you cannot find an exact match for your hard drive, you can try to find a compatible hard drive. Third, you can try to repair the circuit board on your current hard drive. Fourth, you can send your current hard drive to a data recovery company. Why you shouldn't swap circuit boards. If you are able to successfully swap out the circuit board, there is no guarantee that your data will be recovered. Finally, even if you are able to recover your data, it is likely that the recovered data will be corrupt or otherwise unusable. The consequences of swapping circuit boards. This is because the new board may not be able to properly read the data on the drive. Finally, if the new board is not properly installed, it can cause physical damage to the drive. How to recover data from a damaged hard drive. If you have a backup, then you're in luck. However, if you don't have a backup, then you'll need to take some extra steps in order to try to recover your data. When you swap out the circuit board, you're essentially changing the hardware ID of the hard drive. Instead of swapping out the circuit board, what you should do is send the hard drive to a data recovery specialist. They will have the tools and expertise necessary to safely recover your data from a damaged hard drive. Thanks for watching video and goodbye.